All right, <clears throat> I ended up making a, a second batch because of pizza dough because I want to try different things. So this is, uh, let me get the lights a little closer. This was the, uh, this was the first batch. I've already punched it down. Um, I should have divided it though, because I'm gonna eat half of that for dinner. I'm gonna freeze the other half. This one I'm gonna punch down and show you. The big the bowl's a little big, but that's how life goes. So let's let's divide this one out real quick. Put a little flour down. Just a little bit. For safety. That's that's a safety flour right there. Okay. So we're just gonna put him there. We're just gonna go have these. That's, like I said, this is kind of an experiment for me. I don't really know how it's going to, maybe a little too much flour. Let's see if we can get it back in the ball. Um, one of the things when it comes to, uh, what would be the word I want to use? Symmetrical pizzas. The, the, the big, the big trick, I'm trying to get that mash back in there. The big trick is get your ball of dough nice because as it expands, if it's lopsided or got gaps on the backside, the dough is going to make itself get unsymmetrical. And that's kind of a weird, a little bit of a weird concept. But so this one, I'm going to try freezing him. Uh, I'm going to try, I'm going to try vac sealing him and I'm going to see what happens. I don't know. I did a little reading on the internet. Well, the internet's got ideas, and I've got ideas. So my plan here is, <clears throat> this has been punched down, raised again. I only did a 15 minute, because I'm gonna let that raise. So this is kind of a double raise. So I'm just gonna take this guy, and I'm gonna drop him in here. And then I'm gonna vac seal that thing and see what happens. I need to, I need to remember that somehow. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make a note of some sort. So this is a, We'll do a times two on that, so we know that one raised twice. This one over here, I'm gonna punch that down right now, divide it in two, and then bag it. And then we're gonna freeze them, and then I'm gonna cook them, and I'm gonna see how they work. You know that, I'm gonna eat that here in a second, so let me, let me recover that guy back up. It's kind of a large towel, I was doing them both at the same time, but such is life. Okay. So the punch down, that's right, punch. Get my ring on, yeah, I'm eating it. <laughs> it might not be, that might not meet code, food code, but guess what? <laughs> food police aren't coming to my house. So I'm gonna do that thumb slam, push it back in. I'm gonna get some layers in there, put some character in it. I'm a character, my pizza dough's a character. Give it character. Get a nice ball, it's good practice. We're gonna divide that bad boy in half. And then I think I'm gonna reball these guys up. So that one over there, I didn't give him a, a, a ball shape. I just cut him and threw him in because I wanna see how it reacts. I don't know how, I don't know about vacuum sealing this stuff. You know, like one of these. One of these I'm going to leave raw like that. The other one I'm gonna I'm gonna powder it. Because I don't know which is gonna be better for freezing. Is a powdered ball better or is a non-powdered ball better? Well, as a non-scientist, I have to find out. <laughs> so there's a powdered one and a non-powdered one. I'm assuming the powdered one's gonna go into the bag a little easier. But you know. I just need something. So let's get him in there. Whoop. So that's gonna, that's gonna be how we remember him. We'll put a P on him for powdered. We'll go times one P. That's one rise and powdered. Let's get our other bag. I got one sitting right over here. Ta-da! Through the magic of editing. Now this guy is going to be a little more diggy. He's going to stig a little more. So let's see if we can get him to drop down in there. Ooh, there he goes. Got him in there. 
All right, so we're in. We are in. Let's uh, let's move some of this stuff out of the way. Um, yeah, this is kind of still dusty over here. I'm not sure if that's the best place to put my uh, back sealer, but you know what? The things I'll do to make a YouTube video, I'll I will dust my back sealer. See if we can get this a little more into frame here so it's not absolute garbage. Um, There's not everything in the world I want to get videotaped here, but move some lights. There we go. That should work. So, yeah, I don't, I don't know what happens. I don't know what happens when you take pizza dough and stick it in the vac sealer. Maybe you're not supposed to vac seal this. Maybe you're supposed to. Uh... Oh, man. Come on. Cooperate. Maybe you're supposed to uh, put it in a Ziploc bag, or maybe you're supposed to... Fingers crossed. Ooh, that's wild. All right, got him. It's like a little silence there for a second. So this is just a uh, one rise. One rise. No, no dust. All right, he'll go in the freezer. I'm gonna set him over here for now because I, I know videos of me doing things off screen don't make for the most interesting videos. So here's the, here's the powder dust. Let's see if we can get this in a little tighter in here. Let's see if we can, you know, make this happen. See if I can make that video as shaky as possible. Here we go. Good things are happening. This could be a waste of a bunch of flour, yeast, sugar, and olive oil. I don't know. I've never, like I said, this is something I've always wanted to try to do, and I just never got around to trying it. And once I get my technique sorted out, that's what I'll do. And I'll just, you know. When I decide it's time for a pizza, you know, I'll also have to like, you know, take uh, take into consideration how long to thaw. You know, I'm assuming it's going to be an overnight thaw. Let me see if I can get this right up in here for you guys, so we can get a real good. landing okay we'll set those to the side and uh let's uh let's take a look at can i deal with this dough in this video i think oh we got eight minutes oh i think i'm going to call it that's the end of this video that's uh that's vac sealing uh two times rows uh Flour powdered outside, one rise, and then uh, no dust, one rise. And now uh, we'll see what works best. All right. That's that.